welcome to Saturday Sunday School Stories. I'm glad you can make it. I wanted to tell you a story about this one time when I was probably six, seven, eight, right around there. And um, our Sunday school teacher was away. She was on vacation or for whatever reason, she wasn't going to be there this Sunday. And so we had a like a substitute Sunday school teacher. And I should have known that it was going to be like a whack time in Sunday school when it was the one lady who would always literally like flop like a fish at the front of the church on Sunday mornings. So we spent like the first 30 minutes maybe of the class just listening to her obsess about Farmville. Okay, this was like mid, like 2005 ish so like farmville was like a new thing and it was in and you know whatever and then i guess we got sick of like listening to her rant we all started talking about christmas and how christmas was coming up and the gifts that we wanted and you know whatever anyway as we were sharing i could see this like energy rising up in her and eventually she's like shh, 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 everyone stop talking i i have something i need to say and she like calls us all to attention in this really intense way and she's like I need you guys to know something today. If there's one thing, one thing that you're going to remember after, after Sunday school today, I want you to remember that if you take the name of Santa and you take the letters of Santa and rearrange them, do you know what word you'll get? And all of us, like six-year-olds, seven-year-olds, whatever, we're all like, oh, I don't know. Like, what, what, what would that spell if you took it? So we're all like, I don't know, miss, like what, what would it spell? And she's like, it would spell Satan. 